Hi, it's Bart Polson, and this is exercise eight from chapter three of Vijay Monzo's book, Max MSP Jitter for Music. And this is a pretty cool one because what we're doing right here is uh, we've set it up to specify intervals from a bass note, but using a drop down menu to specify the interval. And so what I have right here in this patch is that if I click on this bang, I get a middle C. And this note right here specifies how much to add using the uh, the plus object to create a second note. Now this one adds nothing, it is because it's unison. So I click on that, it's great. But um, I have a choice over here of adding a whole bunch of other things, unison, minor, second, uh, all the way up through octave. And I just wanted to show that I got those by putting them into the inspector. So I'm gonna unlock this patch for a moment and click on this, and I've got the inspector open right here. And uh, as I come down, 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 here's my list. What I've done here is I've put all of these um, intervals from unison to minor second up through octave on this list, and it's very, very important that I put them here in order, because what it's gonna do is it takes each of the items on the list, and it starts with, uh, in the computer science way that the first one is item zero and it goes up through the twelfth item is item eleven so zero through eleven which happens to correspond to the number of notes between the intervals and so we're doing a, a really nice sort of double dipping thing here by simply putting things in the correct order we can also get the correct um, interval from them so I'll just uh, hit OK and then come back over here and I'll lock this back up and so I could say not unison, but give me a minor third. And it shows up right here in this box. And I go, now I have a minor third. And now I can get a tritone. And which is the seventh item in the list. So it's actually item number six on the starting the, on the zero to a major seventh up through an octave, which is item 12 on this list, 0 through 12. And this brings up the name of the item, and this is its number in the list, which puts it into the add function. Anyhow, I think that's a beautiful thing.